everyone, welcome to my guest blog for Education First. I am Mark from the YouTube channel Marque Aventuras and I have been living for more than 20 years here in Barcelona. I love traveling myself, so today I'm going to give you some insider tips for all the students that want to travel here in Barcelona. More specifically, I'm going to give you 10 places you can go totally for free. Let's go to Education First School to start the tour. The Education First Barcelona School is located at 155 Calle de Balmes, very near from the center of Barcelona. The first place that we are going to go is Plaza Catalunya. This is considered the center of the city. You can play with pigeons or celebrate Barcelona victories here. And then the second place for free is to walk through La Rambla. Another of the images of Barcelona, the place is full of flowers, people dressed or people drawing. I will try to go when there are not lots of people, such as at night or in winter, as it can get very, very crowded. The third stop, La Bucaria, a very colorful Catalan market. During your stay in Barcelona, you can enter La Bucaria, a very special market full of colors, fruits, etc. A perfect place to take some pictures. The fourth one, visit La Catedral de Barcelona. Instead of being super expensive like Sagrada Familia, which is around 20 euro, La Catedral de Barcelona is totally for free. I also totally love the atmosphere you can breathe in front of it. You can find lots of people playing music there and you will be able to feel like you're going back in time while entering the Barrio Gotico. Fifth one, do you like shopping? Barcelona is a very good place in case you like shopping. And the best place for that I would say is Passeig de Gracia or Puerta del Ángel. You can find either very expensive shops or very cheap ones. And the cool thing about it is that there are lots of flagship stores so it is worth walking around just to see how beautiful they are. The sixth one, visit La Plaza San Jaume, where the Catalan government stays. If you're lucky, you might even find events such as Castellers, a Catalan tradition. And the next stop, Mare Magno. If you keep walking towards the beach, you will end up in Mare Magno, where the port stays. I really enjoy going there during the night as it is very beautiful to see the lights of the port mixed with a relaxed atmosphere. And then one of the most iconic places in Barcelona, La Barceloneta. Continuing our free itinerary, we will go to La Barceloneta, the most famous beach in Barcelona. You can surf, play volleyball, do sports or just walk there. Having the beach so near from where I live is one of the things I like the most about Barcelona. The ninth, a not so well known place, which is El Labrín Dorta. Yes, although it's the oldest garden in the city and it's very very fun, it's not that well known and it's not that touristic. Therefore, I would totally recommend you to go there. A pro tip, try to get inside and then try to get out very very quickly. It's going to remind you from when you were a kid. And the last one, the 10th place, it's not only one of the best places in Barcelona, but I would say even it's one of the places in the whole world. I have been there lots of times and it didn't used to be so famous, but right now, like people that go there tell to all their friends. And the place is Bunkers del Carmel. This place was used for protecting from the air attacks during the Spanish Civil War. Recently, it has gained much more popularity as you are going to be able to see the whole Barcelona from there for free. People tend to go there and relax while spending some time talking to their friends. I love the atmosphere there. I hope you liked the 10 places I recommended to you. And as a bonus, I'm going not only to give you 10, I'm going to give you two places that are very near from Barcelona and are super cheap to get there and I would totally recommend it to you in case you have some time. The first one is Montserrat and the second one is Sitges. And I have two more places that I will share with you in the description of the video. And in case you end up going to Barcelona, I would love to know which is your favorite place. You can share it with us in the comments. And in case you have any question about them, let me know. Titan.